Slicer is a 3D printing slicing software that converts a 3D CAD model or an STL file into our printing instructions for our Flex Mendel open source 3D printer. So this slicer program slices our models into horizontal layers, very thin horizontal layers. So it tells it tells the uh, 3D printer what to do in its movements. So a configuration file, also known as a config file, is a file that automatically populates all the settings in Slicer. Over here I have my config file that is set up for my printer, 3D printers in my computer lab. Uh, so you will probably get a, configure, a default configuration file when you buy your Flex Mendel 3D printer. Now when I come up into print settings it automatically populates all of these types of things. So all these things are populated with a default configuration file. And if we don't uh, do that, uh, if we uh, don't have the configuration files in there, it goes into what's known as a simple mode. And a simple mode just plain guesses at what settings your 3D printer uses. And most of the time, your 3D printed parts will not come out very well because it's not in the correct settings. Now, when we go to our print settings, we can change these. These uh, config files are just a suggested default settings. And they're applicable for the majority of 3D printing needs, but not for all needs. We could edit the suggested um, settings or the default settings for various types of 3D printing scenarios. We might change them for a prototype. A prototype is a proof of concept. We're just trying to print it out with minimal material usage to see if, if that will work. We could have light strength. This is functional, but not with a whole lot of forces. We could have a moderate strength which is functional with some light uh, forces. These are things like brackets and mating parts. We could have a heavy strength. So it's structural uh, and it has some strong forces like a printed gear or a mechanism of some sort. Or we could have a solid machine if we were trying to make a wrench and we did not want it to break. Uh, we could have some components or rugged applications. Or we could have high resolutions. Uh, so very small parts with intricate detail. Or we could have beginner users where we would make some uh, changes so that beginners are easier to get started with 3D printing. So a configuration file is a file that automatically populates all the settings, the print settings, and the filament settings and the printer settings in Slicer. So it is a file that you typically get from your uh, vendor when you purchase your 3D printer.